Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to show you how in Photoshop we can revert any changes we've made since a document is open and go back to any point in time by using the History panel. Now in order to open up the History panel, if you don't see this icon right here and the sidebar to the right of the main frame, we can go to Windows and History, which will open up the sidebar. Now if we want to make this uh, basically extended on the full section down here, with history selected, we can click on these two arrows, if that's available there. And now we're working solely with the history from top to bottom in this section. So what you're going to see here is a list of all the changes you've made since your document has been opened, all the way going back to when your document was actually opened. So if you want to go back to the very start immediately, without closing out your app and reopening it, you can just click on the open history and it'll go back to how the document was when you opened it back up. Anywhere in between, you just click on the history section you want and it will immediately pop you back to that point in time. So if we want to go back to the current history, we just click down here. Now it's worth noting, if you go back to a certain history point and you start making changes, these new changes are going to be deleted. So be careful. Make sure that when you actually go back to a point in your history that you're okay with losing all of the work that's past that before you actually make changes here on the document. So I want to show one more way that we can use history tools inside of Photoshop. So something called the History Brush allows us to basically draw on a layer that we have selected in the Layers panel. Using the History Brush, we are basically drawing data from a previous point in history. So for instance, if I wanted to revert things back to the initial image here, uh, this books.jpg file, and we select the history brush by actually pressing Y on our keyboard or by going down here to the bottom, which will by default look like these three dots for edit toolbar. And if we right click that and go down to the history brush tool, we can also select it in the same way. And with this layer, we can basically revert back to a previous point in the document. So by basically dragging and drawing here, we're taking this layer and literally pasting the data from a previous point in history onto that layer. Now, the advantage of using the history brush tool is that A, you can put it onto a single layer rather than reverting your entire document, and B, as you can see it being a brush, you can revert only part of your document uh, basically, whatever you draw on will be reverted to that previous point, rather than reverting every single pixel. Just be careful which layer you actually choose to revert the history onto, because regardless of what data was on that layer, it's now going to be overwritten by that history layer. So aside from the traditional Control z for undo, or going up to the edit menu and hitting undo, the old-fashioned way of reverting history, that's just about everything you need to know about reverting your history inside of Photoshop CC 2018. So I hope this video has been useful for you guys. I'm Chris, and I will see you guys in my future Photoshop tutorials.